Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Old Gen vs. New Gen vs. Worlds. New Gen, very ill right now, uh, not really feeling much at the plane. Um, we're gonna go ahead and proceed and resume with our playthrough of Gotham Knights. We already beat the game with playing through different missions with various of the characters, and now we're doing just Robin. When we last left Robin, he had left but Black Gate Prison but just this book. Now he's being asked to open it. So without further ado, here we go. So that visit. Wow. Harley's profiled some seriously antisocial prisoners here. Look, something's going on at Blackgate. We lean on that warden. We're set. Oh, these records go back centuries, man. The warden's new. Now she's involved. How did I miss this? Oh, right. Harley's stupid system makes no sense. Babs. Hey, Babs, what did you figure out? <laughs> they all got out on appeal. That's what Harley was tracking. In every case, key witnesses were murdered. Look. They were all pinned up with knives, just like Langstrom. Bruce is onto something. Oh? I think I've got something. Oswald Cobblepot, the penguin. He's like everyone else in here, except he served his sentence every single time he was arrested. Someone must have hung him out to dry. Might be he's willing to talk. He runs the Iceberg Lounge now. Claims he went legit. <laughs> he definitely runs more than liquor through that bar. I wouldn't know. That man would never take me. <laughs> if you wanted a fake ID, Tim, all you had to do was ask. Oswald's dangerous. And we can't forget, Harley's still out there. We have to be careful. <laughs> Relax. Dick. We got this. Accepted a rather urgent call from Star Labs. This Batman would find a different way in. So, Robin should too.
Looks like Clock King's on timeout. <laughs> that trick umbrella. Classic penguin. U.S. tax code. Doing some light reading, Penguin? A cobblepot coin. I wonder if they were ever in circulation. Ain't seen the bear. I guess I need to get creative. That door's sandalwood. Custom job. Fixing it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Sorry, forgot how to door. But now that I'm here... Smile. Viral video of you assaulting a reformed citizen is the last thing you need right now. Well then, do us both a favor. Tell me why you served your time when your friends didn't have to. Do you just like prison? Hmm. Someone's done that homework. I want to know who's handing out the get out of jail free cards. If you really want to go down this rabbit hole, you need to know there's no coming back from it. That won't stop me. I'm gonna spell this out for you. With the bat gone, you're not worth my time. Get lost. Beat it! Belfry. No luck with Penguin. Whatever he knows, he's not sharing. I added new intel to the board. Penguin wouldn't talk to me. People still treat me like I'm just a sidekick. You may be surprised to learn Batman struggled with similar challenges early in his career. So for a time, he focused his energies elsewhere in the city. When word of his work got out, people were more inclined to cooperate. The city. We've been so focused on Batman's last case, we've let the rest of Gotham slide. Gotham may not know Batman is gone, but it certainly feels his absence. There has been a marked increase in gang-related crime. 
along with whatever Penguin's really up to. Maybe if we interfere with his businesses and that of a few others, he'll feel more talkative. You've also received messages from Lucius Fox and Detective Montoya. They may be able to help. Thanks, Alfred. Guess it's time for this bat to spread his wings. Not only a bat, Master Tim. A robin. An encrypted message from Fox Tecker. It's Lucius. Sorry I've been a ghost since the funeral. But I just realized I forgot to send flowers. If you're ever in the neighborhood, let's meet in my building. I'd like to give you them in person. Lucius Fox wants to give us flowers. Does he know couriers exist? Knowing Lucius, I suspect. When you reach like, uh, you know, Penguin, Mr. Cough, possible to give us any information, there's this high thing going on at Star Labs. We can go check out that action. We're not letting you. I have to check the board, I guess. Penguin stuff, so here we go with the squeeze on Penguin. now. Weird. So that's a penguin crime. Target the penguin's organ trap from the operation to get his attention by reaching the hideout. Let's check that out, guys. Part of me just wants to go across that river. Yeah, let's try it.
That's cool. Across the river, cut out a whole bunch of that distance. I didn't even get on the cycle. That is cool. All right. Some of the bike. So right about here, guys, I bungled the mission out the gate. But what I don't realize is I'm going to attempt to try it over again, not realizing I'm going to have to re-trigger it after completing another mission. So these next few minutes uh, I'm spending in gameplay here are basically pointless. Um, and me even going back. So you're going to see some fast-forward footage through that.
Here we are. Here we go. Got it. Sorry for all the bruises. Sure they don't spot me.
just what I was looking for. Belfry, know where I can find some place cold to put this? I've contacted Dr. Tompkins. She'll meet you at a drop site. I'm kidding. Come here. Dr. Tompkins, I believe this organ is for you. Nothing surprises me anymore with these gangs. Thanks for the delivery. I've got a medical team lined up who can use it. I have to admit, I didn't think I'd be transporting organs today. Heck of a view, huh, Mr. Fox? <laughs> you trying to give me another heart attack? Batman taught you everything, huh? Did get an A on sneaking up on old guys. It doesn't feel like the same Gotham without Batman watching over it all. He always seemed like he was in five places at once. You're getting there. The bat doesn't fall far from the belfry. From what I've seen, anyway. Thanks, I think. Don't thank me yet. The mentor and I always knew that something like this could happen. When I left Wayne Tech, we kept some research going. There are a lot of eyes on you now. But no one's looking at Fox Tekka. As long as I got a breath between the gills, you'll still have everything you need to carry on Batman's legacy. Speaking of which... Is this the flowers? It's Luke's design. A custom bird to help you get around a little quicker. Hefty enough to support exactly one hero. With this, the whole city will be at my fingertips. Now you can thank me. Thank you, Lucius. That drone is a thing of beauty, Mr. Fox. I can't wait to try it. So, how does it work? You're getting ahead of yourself. Before you can use the bird, you'll have to clear a path for it. Dang it, I should have known there'd be a catch. Lately, the GCPD's not content to have jackboots on the ground. 
They've launched a network of surveillance drones to patrol the skies. If they're looking for you when you try to get airborne... I'll probably get shot down. What do I do? A creative programmer could convince those drones to overlook certain targets. But for that to work, close-up scans would be required. So if we can rewrite the drone's programming, I'll be a free bird, so to speak. The cops have the city divided into sectors, with a set of drones watching over each one. Until you scan all the drones in a sector, consider it a no-fly zone. Which means I'm grounded until the drones are taken care of. I'll send you the location of the first one so you can get to work. Got interesting. Robin. Not the person I was expecting to meet, but I suppose Batman trusts you. He has good things to say about you, which is why I think we can make a good team. How can I help? Well, since we lost Gordon, some cops are back to playing dirty again. Kane doesn't like it, but she's not doing much to stop it either. I guess there will always be corruption in Gotham. I know Batman was helping Gordon clean up the force. But now any cops who used to be on Gordon's team are getting their asses handed to them. The gangs are ambushing them because they won't take bribes, and dispatchers are giving them the worst assignments because they make trouble for everyone else. And they won't stop until the good ones are all gone. Look, I hate to ask, but can you keep an eye on cops when they're facing off against the gangs? I know a lot of my fellow officers have issues with vigilantes, but they need the help. Batman wouldn't have made it this far without the help of good officers like you and Gordon. So I'll do it. And who knows? Maybe this will help us make more friends in the GCPD. Thanks. I'll try to get you some resources to help you protect everyone in Gotham, not just us. You can count on me. Well guys, looks like we gave Penguin the squeeze and now we're going to be able to go and confront him again. Until next time, this is Old Jen saying we'll see you on the flip side. Bye now.